everybody, it's Michelle, and welcome to A Day in the Life with me. Today's video is the wheel. This is week 18, or I guess I'm going to continue to call it week 18. 18.1, um, because this is the first one, and then on Thursday will be 18.2. So I do have my base makeup on. It is my project pan. Uh, all of that will be listed down below. And now let's see what the wheel has chosen. Looks like the wheel chose studio makeup. And I believe um, Flawed and Fabulous said that this is like a dupe for an Urban Decay palette. I don't remember which one she said. It does have a mirror. Um, I'm going to try to use the mirror <laughs> just because I, I don't have a lot of room to have my regular mirror. Let me try to scoop back a little and move you guys over a little. And there is Mr. Tigger asleep on the back of the couch. Okay, so it looks like this week is going to be a... Um, <laughs> One moment. Okay, so I swatched the palette. Um, you can't see the first one right here. Um, but I will insert a photo of the first one. This one is Sheen, which you can't see. And then Flaxen. Bear. Gilded is this one right here. Wicked is the dark one. Lace. Again, you can barely see it on my skin. That's I went over it twice. Um, then Dusk is this pink one. Blush, again, it's one that I had to go over a couple of times, and then fake. Okay, hopefully you guys can see it. I'm going to try to figure out a better way to do this, but this is a new number generator that I found, um, and we're doing it on my tablet. Hopefully you can see it starts from one to nine, because there are nine pans. Um, I'm picking five numbers, and then this shows I don't want any duplicate numbers. Okay, and then I can either shake it. Oh, I must have disabled the shake. So I'm just going to click generate. And those are my five numbers. Okay, so I'm going to start with number eight, which you'll see right here. And it is blush. Oh, let me actually open this color switch. And I'm using my bling brushes because that's what I have right here next to me. They were in the bag that I took to my son's last week. Okay, so number eight. There is some kick up in the pan. Um, and I'm using my white NYX primer. Okay. But I'm just patting this over the top. And do the same to the other eye. Sorry if you can hear the dogs. I don't know what the heck they're barking at. Probably their shadows. Okay, and this water, of course, is... Or this water, this eye is watering really bad. Okay, so there was number eight. Now I'm going to go in with number nine. I'm going to use the same brush, not cleaning it off. And again, see the kick up in the pan? And I'm just going to, whoa, that is dark. Um, just pat it here. I'm not going to take this through the crease. <clears throat> Excuse me. Just want to add some color here to the outside. And then... Again, doing the same <clears throat> same thing to the other eye. How is everyone doing? <clears throat> I know here in northern Michigan, um, 
our COVID number has gone up. So we are at a code orange right now. So I am taking hand sanitizer if I go anywhere. I am wearing my mask the whole time. I am keeping our carts, at least a cart distance between me and other people. Okay, so I've done eight and nine. Five, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, here is five. You'll see it up here. And I'm going to take that um, with this ankle brush. And put that right here next to it. And just try and blend it on over. It's a little over half of my eye, over my eyelid rather. And same thing over here. It's always hard to do my left eye. I know a friend of mine um, did a video and she's hurt her shoulder, so that part's not funny, but she had hurt her shoulder and could only put makeup on using her non-dominant hand. And she was joking about making a collab where we put on our makeup using a, your non-dominant hand. I need more here in the bottom. So that will need a five. <clears throat> now I have one and seven. So let me go in with seven. That is this pink color. I'll clean off my brush. I swear to goodness, if my head wasn't screwed on, I would lose it. Where did I put it? No idea where I put it, so I'm just going to use this paper towel. Okay, so now we are going to go in with this one. And I'm just putting that here in the front. It's a very pretty dusty rose color. Don't mind Tigger, he is taking a bath. If he starts chewing on his nails, I will make him stop. My gosh, the dogs. I think all three of them are in the living room right now. Okay, now, <clears throat> excuse me, I'm going to take the this liner brush and I'm going to go back in with number nine. And I'm going to run that on my waterline. Okay, and then I'm going to take number one and just put it in the inner corner. Okay, so here is the finished look. The lip is probably a little bright for this look, but you know. Anyway, the lip is Cara Beauty in Fantasy. And I use the Fuchsia liner. And then mascara and liner are both from Project Pan, along with, I went in with my highlighter from IBY 
and put it in the inner corner because the one that I had in there wasn't really doing it. So here is Tuesday's look. Let me know what you think. Sound off in the comments below. And if you would please uh, be so kind as to go ahead and hit the subscribe button, turn it from red to gray, and then ring that notification bell so you're notified every time I upload a video, which lately has been between three to five times a week. This week probably won't be that much, uh, but it will be at least three. And in the meantime, <laughs> if you, please, please, please wear your mask when you go out. Please. Uh, I am a cardiac patient, so for me to catch it, it, you all know what that means. Uh, for me to contract this virus, it could be deadly. So please, please, please wear your mask when you're outside, when you're like in a group of people. Please wear your mask when you go to the store and so on. Make sure you're washing your hands. Wearing a mask is not the only way to prevent it. You must do that in conjunction with washing your hands on a regular basis. I know it's winter time for a lot of us in the north and you know your hands going to start to crack. Get a moisturizing hand soap. They make those. You can get them at the dollar store or make sure you wash your hands and then put on lotion. It, every little bit is going to help. There's my little segment of paranoia, I guess some people are calling it. Uh, but for me, it's fear. I am afraid to catch this virus. Uh, I'm not done on this earth quite yet. There are days where I feel bah humbug and, you know, one of those, today is one of those days where I'm just not, I'm not feeling my chippery self, uh, but I'm trying and I know the fact that I'm alive and I have a roof over my head, I couldn't ask for a whole lot more. I mean, I could, but I'm not going to be greedy. Um... So please be kind to one another and know that you are loved, you are appreciated, you are important. Bye guys.